Hi guys, welcome back to my channel once again. It's your boy Style One, as you always know, and I am here with this episode about Africa. But please make me a favor, don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell for more videos. And today I am here to talk about the changes or the things as we, the generation of today, as we, the future leaders of tomorrow, what are we going to do to help to take Africa to another level? We all have great people, Wadamaya, Tigris, African Tigris, and we have the African uh, European descendants, black African descendants in Europe and other places who are ready to come back home and join in development in the African continent. So we have these great people who are ready to make a change in Africa, who are ready to change the narration of Africa. And I am saying each and every one of us should participate and be part of these people and help to change the narration of Africa because we are tired of seeing such kind of things. This is what is happening. This is that and that. We are seeing the images that are always been shown on the media. We are tired of seeing these kind of images always in the media. Why not we come together as one people, both the African diaspora? both the African descendants who are born and, born and brought up in Europe and, or in Asia or in America, who are ready to come back home. Why not give them chance? Why not come together, join hands together and make the narration to change? Because so many negativities have been shown. So many things have been changed in Africa. And now we say that is over. We have to take lead. We have to make sure that the narration is well narrated by us. Nobody can do it for us. All what was written before, all what was narrated before was a false narration about Africa. Was just to bring wars or to bring uh, to, to fool others who didn't know nothing about Africa. Africa is a very wonderful place, but we never see those kind of things in the media. Thanks to Africa to the world. The product is doing great. The product is making sure that things change in Africa. And this is happening bit by bit. It will not be a one day work or one month work. It will take long a bit, but there are changes that are coming. Because when we all come in terms, when we all unite and make sure that things happen well, I'm sure in the future we will see a lot of difference in Africa. Because our history, we have to rewrite it. We have to write our own history. We have to tell our own stories, not let others help us telling our stories, which they we are not part of. We were a part of our story. We have to narrate it for ourselves than giving it to people who are not there, who were not part of it, to narrate it for us. For what reason? And now is the time we have to do this for ourselves. Now is the time for us to move Africa where we want it to be. I will leave a link to a brother who is also doing wonders. It's called Twini. I'm going to leave his link on the description board and you can go and follow him too and see what he is doing. Wadamaya and his group are doing great. African Tigris are doing great. We have a lot of them that are doing great to see the changes in Africa. We have all seen them. And we all have voice. Don't be afraid. Don't be scared to say the truth. Come out and speak. Show the world that this is what is Africa. Not to be showing the negative side of Africa alone to the people. Each country has a negative side. 
Even in Europe here, we have negativities, but you will not see them on the media. You will not see them on the media. But they will come to our countries, show us the negative parts only. Are those, the, are, are, are those the only things we have in the country? Or in the continent? Hell no. We have so many beautiful things happening in Africa. But they are not showcasing those things. It's the right time now we start showcasing those things and tell our own stories. And the African Americans, African Europeans, African Asians who are born descendants of Africa, who want to come back to Africa to help in the development in Africa, should be given chance, should be given free will chance to come and join the development in Africa. I mean the people who are ready, who knows where they come from, who knows the, their ancestral home, who knows that they are ancestors are from Africa, should come back home and join the development in Africa. We are all the same. We are all one people. We have to hold one, uh, one another as one Africa. Because the power belongs to us. And by doing that, we will see a lot of changes go, will, will happen. And that we have to help and unite. But first... We have to work on or cultivate our mindsets. We have to start cultivating on our mindsets. When we do that, how can we cultivate on our mindset? Is by coming in town, not by differentiating. This one is from East Africa. This one is from West Africa. This one is from Northern Africa. No, we are all one Africa. One nation, one people. There is not a like difference. But when we follow the people who have been sold out by the others, we will never move Africa to the place we want it to be. So we all have to come together and unite and make sure that we make things happen in Africa for us. Juliet Ryan and the husband and the likes are doing great in the Gambia. Some are in the Ghana. Let's say it in Africa. Most descendants of Africa came back to Africa just because they know what they are going through. They know the reasons of them coming back to Africa. They know why they leave their uh, bad place and come to Africa because of what? They know their ancestors are from Africa. So we have to unite together and make sure that changes happen in Africa. Take your platforms, use your voice in any way you can do it to make sure that we work to see that we are free from all this mental slavery and other kind of things that are happening in Africa. We are tired. Enough is enough. Now it's time to work and make sure that we make things happen in Africa because we are the future and the future is now. So now is the time we have to work. This is what I have for you today. Thank you very much once again for watching. See you in the next video. Don't forget to go and subscribe to Tony channel.